Still in Uza, the first phase of a $7.6 million fish processing plant at Elmina in the central region is yet to be operational. After almost seven years of its inauguration, members of the Government Assurances Committee of Parliament, who assessed the facility during a visit, said the minister responsible for fisheries will be invited to brief Parliament on the condition of the facility. The Almina fish processing plant was inaugurated in 2016 to reduce post-harvest losses and also improve the income levels of fisher folk in the community. It is to, among other things, serve as a storage facility as fish preservation remain a major challenge for fishmongers and fishermen here. The plant, when fully completed, will have facilities for descaling, gutting, filleting, packaging of fish, cold storage and a waste processing component for producing animal feed. However, the Indian Exim Bank grant facility, which many saw as a lasting solution to a major challenge, has been abandoned after the inauguration of the first phase comprising ice making machine and cold storage. When they were commissioned, this discussion with the women started coming, that they could come and do their stalls like as we do in Accra and Tema. But it, the discussions with them realized that they were not willing to pay because this is cold store. You need to pay commercially important rates that can pay even for the electricity. But they were not willing to pay. So that became a problem that even the cold rooms that were about 40 of them, 40 cubicles of them, they were not willing to pay. But it's so we had to rely on just the ice block. In August last year, the Ministry of Transport ordered the refurbishment and inclusion of the Almina fish processing plant into the Almina Fishing Harbour project, which was recently inaugurated by President Akufuado. The Government Assurance Committee of Parliament on Friday, June 2, inspected the facility. Some members of the committee were unhappy about the state of the facility. They started without a consultant, which to me is about worrisome. Mm. Because if you are beginning something, you need the consultant or the technical person to know in and out of the project. As a nation that needs a lot of resources to grow, then we have a country that has helped out with this facility. Then we allow it to go waste. You see, we could start with the storage plant. We could start with that whilst we wait for the second phase to come up. But we have allowed the first phase to deteriorate and we are now going in for help again. No country, no country with future thinking will behave the way we are behaving as a country. No, it is a no-no. The official minister hasn't attended to the committee yet. When he attends to the committee, we will be finding out about a number of uh, uh, issues that we have identified on the floor. The Anomabo Fisheries College is another project which is yet to be operationalized. Rachel Quarty, GBC News, Central Region.